There comes a point in every person's life where destiny knocks on the door and you're like, Destiny, I I've been waiting to talk to you for like a, a long time. And before you can even finish your statement, Destiny's like, hey, do you want things to get really weird? And you're like, well, I, I, I don't know. And then it cuts you off again. It's like, do you want things to get weird? And then you say, yeah, well, that's what we're going to do today. Things are going to get weird because what is an eternal cylinder and what's going on right there, dude? Uh-huh. That's kind of like humans. Humans weren't the fastest or the sharpest of teeth. The Trebhum? Hmm. Uh-huh. Do you see where I'm getting with this? Is this not the weirdest little creature you've seen in your life? Because he sure seems creepy to me, but like creepy in a good way. Like, why don't we take over the world together, you know? Okay, I'm not gonna skip the cinematic. This is strange. <laughs> I don't know where things are going. I just know they're going. Weird place. Yeah, so first off, the game is called Eternal Cylinder. By the way, if you want to play the beta, which the devs so lovely, lovingly? Lovingly gave to me, uh, they said, hey, Baron, please just tell them that they can sign up on the website. Links in the description. Run. No, I don't want to run. What happens if I don't? What happens if I don't run? Okay, the rocks are kind of exploding. This is for science, man. All right, fine, fine. I'll move, I'll move, I'll move. I'll get out of the rocks. Yeah, but it, eternalcylinder.com in case I forget to put it in the video description, as I'm known to do. But it, from what people have been telling me, including my friend Blitz, who, I don't know, people tell me he goes into the forest and like he eats weird little plants and hallucinates and then he comes up with video game ideas. Oh, can I, can I get out of there? Oh my God, what is that? It's a giant gumball. What's behind me? Okay. Oh, the trees are falling. Oh my gosh, that's what it is. It is. That's the eternal cylinder. Okay, I get it. Now I understand. The, the title isn't isn't as weird as I thought. Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't want to die to the eternal cylinder, guys. I, I want to live. It's stopped. Yeah, how do I get out? Do I need to adapt? I'm ready to adapt. <laughs> <gasps> gather materials <laughs> okay i'm gonna gather some some shrooms oh my gosh this is super weird oh my goodness what is that it pooped let's absorb its things okay i can eat these my mushrooms all right i just absorbed that energy poop oh what happened oh i can oh so we eat other organisms um poop this thing's gonna hurt me oh I can shoot anything from my inventory out of my schnout. My schnauzer cannon. Yeah. The Germans, you know, they should have used a schnauzer cannon. So what happens if I schnauzer cannon these things? Okay, I can't. I can't eat those. How do I how do I schnauzer cannon? Why don't they call it schnauzer cannon? Right mouse button is shoot the schnauzer. Oh, okay. Mushrooms don't seem to do much. I need ah rocks. Can I? No, I cannot get the rocks. Okay. Uh, I see giant dinosaurs with neck tongues. Whoa. Hello, brave creature. Giveth me the poopeth. That is magical. Thank you. Whoops. I need it. Oh, that's why. I have too much stuff in my inventory, so I, I gotta spit it out my schnauzer. And then I can absorb and eat it. And give me an evolution. Oh. Oh, what are these? Wait, it got, I got... Huh. Oh, God. What's the giant laser beam throughout the sky? First off, this game is gorgeous. I mean, as is clearly evident. You know, that's one of the key things. It's like, hey... We, we're people and most of us can see and when we're looking at games we want them to be gorgeous and awesome and this one is that what do i what do, what happens in here turn me blue the trebum david attenborough here talking about a crazy cr trunked creature with two legs and two eyeballs eating feces and evolving just like all animals did i should have been paying attention oh okay carry the light but it didn't oh uh-oh oh those things stop the cylinder until eventually they crumble and we must press onwards so ah oh i can roll i'm sonic the hedge trunk that's pretty cool hey everybody it's time to run oh my god are you gonna you're gonna want to eat me aren't you yeah i'm out of here bud you can die. Oh, quickly step on the power symbol at the base of the tower to activate and prevent the eternal cylinder from advancing. Got it. All right, where is the tower? There's a tower. I mean, there's a tower right there. They, they seem to be already ready. Whoa. Oh my goodness, what is that? Okay, things are getting very strange. I feel like those things are activated, right? So this should stop the eternal cylinder. Oh, huh, this is bad. Well, how do I cross the water? Can I swim? We're about to find out. Ah! 
<laughs> Run! The internal cylinder is internal. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh, 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 oh no. <laughs> okay, well, that's great. I need to get to the base of the tower. Wow. This is a very interesting uh, concept for a game. You're supposed to evolve. It's almost like, <laughs> I'm gonna say it, it's kind of a roguelite in that there's permadeath, so it has one of the features. Okay, I got legs. All right, we have to activate these towers. Now how? Apparently, I think I have light inside me. We are a Jedi, maybe. All right, let's get here. Hello, power up the tower. Did I power it up? I can't tell. Yes, I did it. Okay, that should buy me a little bit of respite here. And there's some, what are you? Hello, Mr. Snaily Snail. <laughs> Give me your eyeballs. Guys, is this not the strangest game? I kind of love it. I'm very confused. Oh, I'm going to eat this. It's about as big as me. Oh, all right. What should I shoot it at? Pew. Oh, it kind of turned orange. Oh, you know what? Grill it. It's heating it up, right? Oh, a new family member joins the group. Grogu. He's like Grogu. Enter name. That sounds good. Enter name, Grogu. Yay. Okay, now, will you just follow me or will you kind of just do your own thing? All right, I'm eating these little things. What happens if I eat it? Does my energy level go up? Okay, so we need to look for these things. It's so strange because it's like, it didn't tell me what to do next. Oh, that's good. All right, I think I should be able to... Oh my God, every plant and creature is just something totally foreign. Now this thing's clearly dangerous, right? I mean, it should be. Oh, oh my God, what is that? Run, 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 run. Oh, okay, well luckily, Wooj has died. Okay, Wooj, you're dead. Now I'm Grogu and uh, he's still coming. Okay, well, we're just gonna run. Oh, and this is like a cold biome and I am not adapted to the cold. Oh, okay, that sounded dangerous as well. Now, do we try to ford the river here? Are these like, what are you? Whatever we just did, we killed it. Doesn't look like I'll do well in the water. Yeah, but that's the giant dinosaur looking thing over there. It's like carrying an orb on its back. Ooh, that is some kind of a sea creature. Almost looks like a jellyfish. I guess what I'm worried about is at what point are these towers gonna fail and the eternal cylinder is going to start moving again. It almost looks as if there's an energy field or like some kind of a barrier over there. I don't know how far I can go. Oh, and this tentacle thing is actually a monster. I'm fairly certain. So I don't think we want to trigger that. What are you guys? <laughs> Look at this thing. It's like a dog. Fire! Oh my. Oh, that's how it eats. It's like a Jar Jar Binks mixed with a Brachiosaurus mixed with some kind of creature that does that. So I, I, I don't know what that is. All right, what happens if we try to trigger this giant serpent thing? Nothing, I guess we're, he's so big and we're so insignificant in size, he's not even bothered by it. Now there's this blue stuff, which I would imagine is some kind of a fume. No, we're, we don't seem to be bothered by it. Maybe it's luminescent, right? And it's not necessarily like gaseous, it's just light. Oh. Oh, look at this thing. Oh, he got out of his shell and then he got back in. There was something in it. What did he do and how do we get him to do that again? Because unfortunately, the good version of me died. The one with the evolutionary jumping. All right, I'm hidden. You can't see me. Oh, it worked. Let's see if he gets out again. Oh, there he goes. There he goes. There's something in it. Oh, no, no, I want that. Okay. Oh, shoot. I know what the issue is. My inventory is full. Now, where is that thing? I want it. There it is. Hard shells. Some ingredients cannot be eaten until their edible interiors have been exposed. There are multiple ways to to break open ingredients. Try experimenting with throwing them, crushing them, or feeding them to other creatures. Okay, items with a breakable exterior are marked with a yellow border. Okay. Okay, so that's, this is a breakable one. Oh God, but I, I just lost it again. Oh, there it is. Oh no, no, that's a weird doggy dog thing. Where did it go? Oh, where to go? Your Trevum is too young to swim across. Watch for the beams of light that come from activated towers. Okay. Oh. Oh, and look, we have this thing stuck in us, right? So I'm gonna try to do this. I think it's one of those evolutionary things. Boom! Oh my. Okay, that's not breaking it. I think I might need something to eat it. Where the old things dwell, that's not creepy. Okay, I'm fairly certain that it's telling me to go up here to this guy. I think I should be able to swim and get on it. Whoa. All right. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh my goodness. Music is really trippy. This whole thing is just very weird and trippy. In a very fun and like, I need to find out more about this game. All right, giant worm thingy. The tower tells me I need to come here. Whoa. All right, so... Oh, almost fell off. Okay. Oh, there's a little thing down there. And there's this evil thing looking at it. Hmm. Now, please don't die. All right, we're doing this. Oh, oh shoot. Oh, well, could have been worse, I guess. Oh, oh, you don't see me, big guy. Ooh, okay. We're almost to this platform. Beep. Is there fall damage? Uh, I guess not. Oh, I need... Whoa. Hey, bud. I actually need three of them. It looks like we need three of these guys in order to open this door. Got it. And I randomly got a second one somehow. Maybe... Maybe that's the one I was and he died. And by getting here, we got back to the land of the living. Oh, God. That looks dangerous. Eat that, you jerk. Ah! Hey, buddy, come here. We will survive if we walk across the water. Oh, there's another egg. Okay. How do I get that? Some creepy music and he just pooped blue gas. Got it. All right. So we need to get that egg from there and put it in the griller. Now, how on earth do you do that? Oh, okay. I can shoot water. Wait, maybe that's what I need to do is shoot water over there and push it out from this cliff. Oh, yes. Okay. That actually worked. What is that noise? That usually means bad things are happening, I think. All right. Get the egg. Stop the cylinder. Stop. Step on the power symbol at the base of the tower to activate and prevent the... Oh, oh God. Okay, where's the nearest cylinder? Here, I'm out of energy. Oh God. Oh no. We just gotta go. I gotta remember where that lake is. Step on the thing at the base. Man, this really requires... Oh God, I can't get in there. There's not a symbol. I don't have a symbol. Man. All right, I can change trebums. This one, Woosh, can jump. All right, so I gotta find the symbol at the base of the tower, but I don't see one. Ooh, evolution. It worked. It gave us legs. Oh, you know what? Okay, what I need to do, I should have given the other one that. The grasshoppers. What happens when I water those? Nothing that I can tell. All right, well, I, I guess that was a false alarm, and I have the egg. We're gonna get a third trebum and then awaken the beast, I guess. Huh. I got a bad Just gonna feeling dodge about this. this guy. Nope, nothing to see here. We must go to the sacred grill and put the egg forth at some point we will get this right so i should be able to what hold it there right yeah a new family member vegu okay good so now that we have three we should be able to unlock the gate let's roll boys and girls or whatever we are Woo! come forth to the platform yes huh hmm we unlock the gate to this either a, a gateway a temple something Enter the elder cave. Okay. Things are going to get very strange here. All right, we're in the cave. It's locked behind us now. Um, Q. Okay, I like I like which trebum I am now. What is that? Can I get those melon things? Let's see if I can't eat one. Didn't seem to do anything. All right, grasshopper poop makes us get legs. Ooh. Uh, whoa. Organic cube. A rare organic growth found near certain ancient trebum structures. Most likely artificial in origin. All right, so these are all the things we've found so far. Okay, so creme creme. There's some weird stuff, man. I think these are all the things that we've encountered so far. And we know iridescent pearls are trebum. Wait, actually, no, no, no. Those are not. These are the... It's overwhelming. Whatever. Oh, okay, there it is. Yes. Shoot the water. All right, I'm gonna get... I'm gonna make Grogu the square one because I'm pretty sure this is gonna make me square. Look, wait, this trebum's made of stone? Why are you made of stone? Oh, look, and there's another one. Oh, I'm gonna evolve. It's happening. Evolution gone wild. <laughs> Oh, okay, Woosh. Woosh, you're gonna get the other one. Now, there should be a third one then, right? To make us all square? Oh, another one just popped up here. Now, Vigu, you need to be... There we go. Okay. Uh, I think we should all be able to make it through this door now that we've evolved from little rhomboids into cuboids. Okay. This is hilarious. So, this allows us to gain access to places where no one else is supposed to be <laughs> because they can't turn into cubes and this is a gurumo the old elder okay so i think it's clear that we can get very large right i've never played spore can someone tell me how similar to spore is this i was happy to see some friends okay oh what huh who are they that looks like a a vehicle mixed with a monster <laughs> Oh my gosh, this is so crazy. All right, how do we get out of here then? Oh, well, I think it's quite obvious we go through the giant lit up cave entrance here. And then where do we find ourselves now? The gate is opening. <laughs> uh, 
Oh, who's this? Okay, this guy needs some kind of a weird block. It is a little daunting. Huh, okay. You know what? I bet I can eat a fish. I'm gonna eat one of these fish with my schnauzer. Hello, fishy. Come back here. Oh, I can't get too deep. I think things are gonna eat me if I go out too far. We need to find a fish that's close to shore. We get a little tired, don't we? Yeah, we need webbed feet. Oh, look, there's another uh, gate over there. Is is that the one we were... Yeah, that's the one that's holding back. Okay, here's the fish. Oh, he's, uh, he's along the shore. Get him. Get him. Yes. All right. I think this is going to give me webbed feet. Oh, oh, yes. Okay, we need to get everybody else that. What is this thing? That thing oh kind of looks like God. a plant to me. It's just like a farting plant. This is... Oh. Uh oh, guys. Oh, that's okay. Run, run, Trebum. The flying thing is after us. All right, now I'm gonna go catch more for my friends here. Okay, so I poop it out and then I queue over here and you eat it. You get web feet. I'm learning, guys. A high jump out of the water. You just need one more fish and then everybody has the web feet. And he needs some kind of a, a material here, but I don't know what it is. Okay, these are some mark structures. They look like Trebum. Awakening the cylinder. Exiting the blue energy dome that radiates from the tower you activated will awaken the eternal cylinder. Hmm. Okay. Then we don't want to go too far out, do we? We're not ready for that. Oh, here we go. More fish. Just in case there's more. All right. Big feet doesn't have one. Okay. Eat that fish. Oh my God. Oh God. I don't like that thing at all. Oh, what? Yeah, we didn't like that. Some kind of noxious fumes. I think it's like our brain needs to evolve to a certain level. <laughs> I think they just high-fived. Okay, what's that? Huh. Okay, that gives you water. Certain things refill your water. Certain things refill mushrooms, but we don't really have that just yet. This guy heals your life. Shoot water at it. Oh, oh, this is something. Let's the trouble make a sound that will start or frighten predators. <laughs> that's amazing. Oh, there's something up there. Oh, oh, that's his eggs, isn't it? Is there a griller around here? Oh, it just, huh, it just had food. I couldn't evolve from eating what was in the inside of that egg. All right, we could go, but then the eternal cylinder will follow us. All right, let's see if I can't scare him away. Uh-oh. I, I don't think he has the alarm. Dang. Be scared. Be scared. He's not scared. I mean, we could make a run for it, should we? If we if we go past this, the eternal cylinder will keep going. Uh-oh. All right, we've got to get to the next barrier. Oh my god, impending doom. Oh man, there's so many weird things around here. So many things to explore and discover, but this cylinder all right, we need to get to here. We'll roll. That gets us there significantly faster. There it is. Here is salvation. Oh, and that's the dude that gives me the jumping legs. Give me the poop. Okay, run, run, run. Ah! Oh my God, it's like right here, isn't it? Oh my God, yes it is. We made it. Come on, everybody. Oh, uh-oh. Only two of us made it. Okay, well, this is quite... Whoa, it's another temple. Oh! <gasps> All of us made it. Okay, now who doesn't have the jumping legs? Or does everybody have them? Okay, maybe none of us had the jumping legs. Good to know. So one of the things is if we see those grasshopper guys, which I think they got exterminated, um, we shoot water at them, and then that will allow us... I mean, seriously, this is very lost. Yeah, seriously. Okay. The light that stopped the cylinder. All right, we're gonna enter another Trebum shrine. Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> what, what was it? Tell me what it was. Oh, what's this thing? Oh, okay. I just, oh, I just got something. It's a, it's an egg thingy and I need this. To, what's that over there? I just don't know how to break these things. Yellow means it has a breakable structure. All right. This will allow me to evolve into something. What is it? I have spikes. Grass like hair, which attracts sack flies. Sack flies, come here. Come hither. I will attract you with my delicious grassy head come to me oh it attracts them but they i still have to destroy them i guess now can i just oh wow so we're full health got it okay that's good now let's pick someone else grogu you get the next one huh it's very strange you know and i don't know how to what is this okay that's not weird can i eat it i need the sack flies to come here oh sack flies whoa, whoa what was that he's just rolling okay they're playing can't get in there but they're coming here they're coming to this area so maybe oh we got one we got a few oh i powered it up what happens now <gasps> what is it i will go into the light perhaps it could help them there was a great power in this place, something from the days in when even the elders were young. In this strange eerie temple, the Trebum felt something stir in their memories. To keep carrying the light they held within them, 
The light that stopped the cylinder. Okay. Here's my... Oh, cool. I have an inventory. I have a map. Oh, there's another little structure. There's like a lot going on here. Huh. Yeah. There's a map and... I'm supposed to do something here, but maybe I can jump up here. Almost. Because that just looks like I need to get it, right? That isn't... That's something that can help me evolve. Whoops. Whoops. Wait, what is this one again? The cubes, maybe? Oh, no, that was new. Oh, oh, it made me round it again. Whoops. Oh, no, no, I'm, I have like a turtle-like hair. I, I am... I am... What? So now I'm stronger against predators. So here's my inventory. How do I use this map? There's that serpent thing. I think I have to come back later in order to get that. So we'll exit the shrine, but if you guys do want to see more Eternal Cylinder, let me know. It's quite a fun and unique game. Oh, oh, what is it now? Oh my. Oh, yeah, there's something. Yeah, I think you're right. Oh, run! But, and remember, you can sign up for the beta on EternalCylinder.com. Oh, we don't like that. That ate one of us before. This is an incredibly strange and hostile world. The evolution mechanics are pretty crazy because <laughs> you have to eat the little things around you and you learn through doing, you know? You don't know what will evolve you and what won't until you try, which I guess is part of the whole process. So if you guys do want to see more, well, let me know because there's the next tower right there. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one.